Oh, a text message, hello. No, it's a spam email. <laughs> I need to learn how to hang the skateboard. Welcome to probably the most, whoa, bubble. I got a bubble, this is perfect. <laughs> hey, what's up guys? <clears throat> Welcome to probably the most boring background of life. I've got a 1975 gold record, and I've got my thermostat, which is set at uh, 22. What's up everybody, so I'm back in Toronto. I'm actually in my new place right now. I've got a lot to do. Today's video I wanted to do something really cool because you guys have reached out to me in the past saying, can you give us ways to make money as like teenagers? So today I'm gonna give you guys six creative ways to make a couple extra bucks. You're probably looking for money because, well the holiday season just finished. Everybody's gotta give gifts, we're all freaking broke right now. Me in particular, because I just moved into this place. You got a big weekend coming up, you got a vacation you've planned, whatever. These tips will help fund that, uh, help you get some money. Let's get into it. Tip number one. So what you have to do is go online and buy my book. I'm gonna give you the first four, I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's the worst. That's the worst when you're trying to find some quick help. And they're like, just buy my book. I give you the rest of the tips on page four. I'm going to give you six legit tips. Let's go right now. Tip number one. This one's easy. You guys may have already thought of this already, but take your stuff that you're not using and sell it on eBay. I don't know how to do that. Well, look in your city. There are stores that will sell the items for you, and they have to take a little percentage of it. Like, maybe you have an extra skateboard lying around like this, and I want to sell this. I go, on, I go on eBay, make a seller's account. I can sell this. Make like five bucks, okay. Number two, okay, this one, this one's really weird and you guys are gonna be like, how did you possibly find this one? If you have long hair and you're looking for a haircut, if you need a couple bucks, you can actually sell your hair on buyandsellhair.com. You can make up to $500 for 10 inches of hair, which is crazy because I know another way that you can make $500 with 10 inches. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was so inappropriate. Anyways. <laughs> Next one. Trick number three. If you're in a big city, grab a camera and go take pictures of beautiful parts of your city. Whether it's a skyline, a pond, a nice park, whatever. Take the photos. Email companies around, travel companies uh, around your city saying, hey look, I've got these great updated pictures of our city. Do you wanna buy them? Totally great way to make some extra cash. Tip number four, review songs. There are websites on there, if you just go and Google and say, review songs for money. There's tons of websites out there where you can actually review amateur artist songs and then you will get compensated for it. You can even do that from your own home. You can do that from your desk. Trick number five, I think I keep switching between trick and tip, whatever. Number five, become a hangover helper. Now you guys are like, what the hell is this? If you live near a college or a university uh, or you just live near a, a really bumping part of town with a lot of bars or whatever, advertise your services online as a hangover helper. Hangover helper means the morning that people wake up after partying, you go over to their house, you clean up after the party, you can bring them breakfast, which is another service you can offer. You can bring them Gatorade, another service you can offer. You're just there to help them. Hey, I'll clean your place for 100 bucks. People will pay for that. Be careful with that one, guys, because you are going in somebody else's home, so be very careful with that. And last but not least, trick tip number six. Go on Craigslist, and here's the trick. Go on Craigslist and go into the freebie section. Pick up a bunch of free stuff from Craigslist, and then you're gonna refurbish it very cheap. So whether it's a chair that just needs to be painted, buy, take the chair for free, invest in the paint, paint the chair, then resell it. There's a lot of people that have stuff for free on Craigslist that just wanna get rid of it because it's taking up space. You then go and take it, it could still have some value. If not, put value into it by refurbishing it and then resell it. Genius, freaking genius. So you guys have it, those are six creative ways to make a couple bucks. Thank you guys so much for watching. I cannot wait to show you this place. I'm now back in Toronto. I've been here for like five days. I still need to get settled in, but very excited to show you guys uh, the new head office of the Danocracy. Literally, I'm gonna have an office in this place. That is Danocracy, it's gonna be sweet. For those of you that don't know, on my social media sites, whether it's Snapchat, Twitter, even Instagram, I do contests for free, free stuff. So this time it was free stickers. I will be sending those out shortly. A bunch of you guys will be getting some free Danocracy stickers. Um, and that was an Instagram contest, I believe. Maybe I'll do one on Twitter next. Anyways, you can follow me on Instagram, at Danocracy. I'll have some contests on there, I'm sure. Follow me on Twitter, at the Danocracy. Subscribe to my channel, baby. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. See you guys later.